This had me fooled. And it looks like a, from a distance, it looks like a Sasquatch. If this is a Sasquatch, he is in a camo cloak right now. So what's really sticking out to me is this is where his head would be. But what's really convincing me is this right here. That looks like a shoulder. Looks like he's sitting down. I mean, look at him, it just looks... I'm really feeling Sasquatch on this one. I'm getting the Sasquatch energy. Like, there's his face. I can almost see his lips. But he's totally green and mossy. And then there's his... I'm going to start at his head. Shoulder. Shoulders right there. Left deltoid going down to his bicep. It's his left arm. His body. That is a Sasquatch. He has the most amazing camo cloak I've ever seen in person. I hope you all can see this. But I saw it with my own eye. I wasn't sure. That is awesome. Here's his face. And his head. You see his hair. This is his chest. And then what's really defined is his shoulder. Like there's his head, and you see that trap muscle right there. Little bump. His deltoid is right there. And then his arm goes down. It looks like his arm's laying across his lap there. Look how well he blends in. Oh my gosh. That is freaking amazing. This is probably the best camo cloak that I have ever witnessed in person. If you happen to know a guy named Ed Waterman, rest in peace, my buddy, he passed away years ago, but he would capture the most amazing camo cloak from Sasquatch. This is a Sasquatch, ladies and gentlemen. This is not a mossy stump. I can see definite parts, I see hair. I see his face. Head. That's awesome. Thank you, my friend. Shoulder, deltoid, chest. He's just sitting there relaxing. That's gorgeous. Oh, look what's up behind him. Is that one? sure about those so I can't see but that's definitely a Sasquatch what a beautiful he's big too that's a male look how well they blend in it's just so amazing they are amazing beings I mean, I hope you guys can see this. You guys might be thinking I'm crazy, but I know I'm not crazy. There's his face. His face is right there. He's got a, he's an ancient one. 
He looks human. His face has very human-like qualities. I see his nose. I see his lips. I see the hood of his hair. There's his head. I can distinguish between moss and his hair. Gosh, that is amazing. Now I'm starting to see his eyes. Oh. Keep it together, Mike. Beautiful. There's his, his left shoulder. His trap muscle. You can see his deltoid arm going down. So, I can see energy. Look where his heart chakra is. Right there. He has, he has more energy right in the center of him than all around. His heart chakra is highly charged right now. I mean, I see the distortion from his... It's almost like... It's almost like I can see a distorted looking orb where his heart chakra would be. Right there is his chest. That's where his heart would be. Or oh, is. They have the, some of the most amazing hearts of any species. That is definitely a Sasquatch in camo cloak. Large ancient one. So when I say Sasquatch and ancient one, Sasquatch have more conical pointed heads and uh, different facial features. Ancient ones have more rounded heads and they have more human-like features. This guy is an ancient one. But he is gorgeous. And no, I'm not going to go over there and shake his hand. I'm not going to harass him. I'm going to leave him alone. But he is just resting. Obviously, he knows I'm here. And he knows I'm filming him. Look at the hair hanging off his arms. Oh, this is so amazing. What a treat. Gorgeous. Oh, all right, look at that. So amazing how they can just blend right in and just be still. I'm gonna leave them alone now. Thank you, my friend. Wow, that was awesome. <laughs>